Hello guys, welcome back. I am Daily Fix and we are going to be continuing our page, page playthrough. Well, I adjust this thing. I just noticed that uh, I was about to lose a screw. I don't want to. <laughs> so, uh, what did we do yesterday? Yesterday evening, yesterday night for me, morning for some. Is, um, let's just get my hot pack. Uh, there we go. Uh, we did. Uh, we went to the dungeons. Uh, we also got two retainers. And those two retainers we're actually going to be summoning right now. Because they should be done. Now. He's also trying to sell 12 items. Which we all probably know. That is never going to happen. His venture is complete. Is there anything I can change there? There's no hiring or it doesn't really matter. I made one a minor. Uh, the other one is uh, is also a mage. Probably because we can only get two for free. Uh, I, I might change this at some point. Either to like a fisher. Or a botanist. Uh, I'm not sure what is wisdom in this. I might even... Uh, Get a few more. If you've seen videos where people have like nine or ten of them, um, they paid for it. Wait, what? Well, I don't think he actually sold anything. To be fair. Now he did level up and we got animal skins again. Let's reassign him. Now, unfortunately, we only have three more venture points. I'll just make him do the same thing until he's done. Uh, let's summon oh, Actually, he did make money. Look at that. Almost 3,000. Okay. Did not expect that. I'll be very honest. Uh, let's go. Uh, it might go back. Complete. We got a uh, few more lightning shards. Just, just let them keep them. I know we can get more. I know we can get more. Uh, but at some point, you know, um, we'll be joining a grand company. So, yeah. I think that's going to be fun. Uh, grand companies, there's three of them. Uh, from what I know. So, yeah. Be awesome. Let's take a look here. Uh, what were we doing again? Yeah, this one's level 35, 25... 20 is the main story one. The hidden chap uh, the hidden chapter is uh, probably the final final mission we get for before we become a a black mage. So I wonder if we should do it now or just wait until we catch up after the Lord of Inferno. Um, so we need to go back to dry bone also we need to make sure we keep on leveling our mining skill because currently we're like level 14 and our retainer won't be able to get higher than level 14 that is how i think it goes like i, I don't know because like i said this this is all very new to me what we could actually now do is instead of I think if we go to the western over here there's actually level 15 with New Horizon do we have missions in the western region and we have this one Interesting. It says Western, but we clearly need to be in the Eastern. Okay. I guess. Um, did we find that final hunt? That's in Eastern as well. This is in the Eastern. So we will um, we'll just go to Camp Drybone. I'm hoping, honestly hoping we can find something to mine over there. I wasn't very lucky last time. 
um, let's say hello guys, hello all, well, and it's not abandoned that, if I press save the land, nothing, yeah that, that's annoying, that's annoying, we need to be, I'm thinking in here, and I was wrong, <laughs> Yeah, this map layout is it's either going to be this door or the one next to it. There's two options. It is actually it, it's the flame sergeant. Yeah, I think we're going to be getting that grand company thing going. Yeah, okay, we're gonna be oh wait, we're going to be getting these guys with us then. I am wait. I, I can definitely do that. Where is that? So there was there is that dungeon. So the invisible inferno is over there, and we also have a mission. With uh, oh, this is the level thirty-five one. So this is probably going to be the next region we'll venture out to. Cool. I love to see new regions because they do look absolutely wonderful so we'll start off by doing this one there is there must be something to mine over here so we'll switch back it's actually quite handy if we do stuff like this actually just get sneak up it is such a good skill such a good skill uh, we'll just go into that direction. We'll switch back when we get there. If by the odd chance we um, we find something. Oh, there's actually another way up here, of course. Oh, I always do that. Always do that. Kind of hoping that we do actually find something more. Uh, one other thing. Um, hot layout. Like, I want you to be back over there. Back over here. Do you guys care about how much gill I have? I don't. I don't think so. But I was actually a bit annoyed about how this looks. Uh, if you up there, it will freedom, and we're actually changing the layout of this. Go with two rows of. Why can I not move you? Uh, it's save you. Just put you down... There. Inventory and notices can be... Oh, oh, yeah, that's fine. Something like this... Would be okay. There we go. I think... It's a bit... More tidy? <laughs> I don't know, honestly. Just, just give me something to mine, please. Yeah, it's actually already over there. I think. Yeah, it's ex these maps they they feel extremely large, but it's actually quite funny how fast you go through these things. Okay, nothing over here, huh? Absolutely not. The rocks enough. There's, there's plenty of rocks. Just, just. It could be that is more of a, um... <laughs> Aiden, how are you doing? Or is it... Etienne? 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 Scratching my head here again. How are you today? Welcome back. Go back to being a mage. Like, we've been in here. This is where you get the gear, like, level 15. No one knows how to pronounce it. I don't, too. Wow, so... Okay, that is interesting. You just liked the look of it. Really clever, actually. Alright. See, all... Every time, it's... All classes. Just pick, pick the money. 
Not in the, not going there. Why would I go in here? What is this for dungeon? Wait, actually, it is a dungeon. Are you kidding me? I thought this was just a guide thing. Oh, okay. Really? Can't use a um, an NPC party. We'll see if something happens. Now, it's for those of you wondering why I put Fire Free up here, it's it's mainly because we level sync quite often. It's also extremely expensive, though. I wonder. I wonder if actually anyone is going to be going there. Uh, let us start moving. Oh, here's actually the hidden chapter. Really now? Let's go to the invisible city. So we'll, uh, we'll just TP back. And then we'll start walking. I don't like this camp at all. <laughs> it's um, it's just, uh, just I wish there was just a way up here or so, just so we can just head over to the right direction. A virtual waiting time nine minutes. I don't, I don't know. I, I honestly, I don't know. Sad thing is, I've seen this increase. Uh, also, also, um, I've just installed uh, the game on my laptop. So we need to make a decision here. I'm, I'm thinking I'm not allowed to do storyline stuff. But I'm also might be inclined to make myself a character that I'll be using like off. Off, off camera, off stream, on, off Twitch. Bloody imps everywhere. Uh, I don't really feel the need to fight. Off stream, yeah, thank you. Yeah, that's actually, that would be the right terminology. Terminology, I can't even tell you how to write that. Okay. Hey, look at that! Well, isn't that great? There's rotting corpses over here. Let's cleanse them with fire. Holy crap. Okay, 131 on the... F oh, wow. Immediately up to the third one. Damn. Okay. Not bad at all, but my M... Okay, need to be careful with that. Three of them is all of my MP. Something over there as well. That's the destination. Rodding Noble. Ew. Ew. Nobody likes Rodding Nobles. Let's go. So this increases up to three immediately. So what if we use now number one? Because that's actually not as bloody expensive. That means that we'll switch this around. Like we'll start with that. Go with a bit of thunder. Now we can just go up to three. Yeah, we don't need to use this one. It's extreme. Oh, actually, there's a proc chance now, which I find extremely. Yeah, nice, awesome. Yeah, apparently, it the game will start telling you when it can proc something. I'm not sure yet how, <laughs> how it works. Uh, but like I said, man, you, you guys are way more versatile in this sort of stuff. But I didn't know I could go up to three already. Like, I probably missed it if I go to... No, Swift Trait? Yeah, Aspect Level Master 3. Yeah, we got that at 35. Really, no. And uh, we get Maim and Ment at 40. So, I I is it changing to... 
Black Mage at level 40 then? I, w I was thinking about like level 30. Okay, level sinking to 24. That's why I want to do like the majority of... Huh? I think it's because of this. Yeah, okay. I, I don't think it's going to happen, this. So let's withdraw from it. We could also assign all of them. And there's also some roulette stuff. Like, adventurer needs a healer. I am I'm not here. I, I, I don't think fire will heal you. To be fair. I, I just don't understand. At all. It's fine. Eventually. Eventually. I'll, I'll know. I hope so. Him again. Oh, he's the bait. Ah, oh, this is... What if the traitor is one of these guys? Oh, he is so dead. That's awkward. Yeah, see? I knew it. I knew it. Uh, it's actually a very healthy fight. Hopefully it is going to be interesting. Just start doing multiple AoEs. You can't use Thunder, which is a bit of a shame. No, well, can't have everything. Right. I think we need to start dealing with these folks here. I think my Plugalus just died. Yeah, my Plugalus uh, is no more. Yeah, he's actually a healer, which is quite annoying. I actually know my Plugalus is right over there. Do they keep spawning? Okay, we're going to be focusing on him. I think there is uh, no other way. I don't. I, I think they just keep spawning. So 
right, let's go to the sergeant. Hopefully you can pull off some of that aggro. And we can just use our AoE to get rid of these two alts. to win the fight like this. Sleep? Oh, they're all dead. They're not actually. So, why are they bound and I'm not? Oh, Ember is not. Is this a dungeon? This actually needs a DPS. Uh, yeah. Apparently, this is a dungeon. Yeah, uh, we'll go with a group of NPC. So we can just immediately go in. It's the primal. Sure, it changed a bit since like Final Fantasy X. serves you right.
What? Is, is it like everyone hexed or something? See, this is not a dungeon, this is just, just a boss fight. Interesting. Uh, if my tank would be so kind. Right, so he's going to be probably doing a lot of these uh, areas. I did feel that was a bit mean, but... That Marauder is not having the best of time. That's actually hurting him quite, quite a bit. I'm thinking I might do a Marauder, like, as, a, as, another, as an alt. Don't trust that. Yeah, I. St oh, oh, that's mean. That's mean. I didn't. I didn't see that in time. Oh, I have to pay more attention to that. I was still used to the like the very orange circles. Fighting a primal is probably not the most tough thing you can do then. Okay, it tries to something. Since terrible power, that isn't okay. And yeah, we need to kill that. think. I hope. The others are attacking it, so I'm, it's, it's probably what I should be doing. Oh no. Oh, for a moment there? Uh oh, what the hell? We failed. Okay, so we need to go fast. That thing needs to go down faster. We also have the limit breaker, but I don't think that's going to do anything for us. Okay, what can I do that does more damage? use uh, swift cast here and there it saves like three seconds it probably would have been enough if we see limit break activate I will have to use it immediately I need to pay attention to what's around me don't get hit to look to the inferno okay I need to take a look at what he is shouting. Yeah, I hate that attack. Honestly, I do. Uh, 
Alright, I lost my, um... Probably did something wrong there. Uh, he should be summoning that thing again. Alright, here we go. So now that that weird thing comes in. Hopefully that will help. Don't let myself be too interrupted too many times. Probably... You know, Thunder is still a dot. Come on. No. We died. I'm still alive? Oh, we had to go towards him. Oh, okay, 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 okay. Now I know. Oh, here you go. I'll take that hit. Just so we can damage him. Maybe we should have waited with that. Maybe I should have waited with that. Okay, new attacks. Cool. I like that. I like that he's doing new attacks. Like, this is like his second version. I'm thinking he will summon that thing again. And now I know I just need to make sure that we're with him. So everything dies that is not close to him then. See, they're all running towards him. They know what's happening before it happens. Love that. Like they have to they have some foresight or something. Oh, he's almost down. So the next one's going to be in. See, he's going in already. There he goes. Okay, they actually do know. <laughs> Just pay attention to to your guys around you, I would say. There you go. Ah, that was actually way easier than I hoped. But what I do like is that they are giving you more and more um, interesting bosses. Okay, we got a, uh, a red flame thing. say red flame thing, I'm, I'm meaning like a red crystal. I don't know why I said red flame thing. this guy always late with his army of three with him
just a just a prime. Who needs Ella? Who needs enemy? Okay. What, no chest? Seriously. So we're already back over here. We're not synced anymore. That that's good. This is. Yeah. Well, we'll. Um, I'll. I'll start doing like achievement hunting once we reach like level eighty or so. Just always late. He's never been on time. This time, if we have to go back to like, yeah, the walking sand, uh, I'm not going to do it walking because, well, you know, we can use these, and I kept forgetting them, so I kind of feel like an idiot. Uh, level 20, so yeah, we're getting close, we're getting close to whatever it is that we do. Let's go, let's use it. Man, this is so. I feel so dumb. And I'm thinking, like, we're here now. This is so much better. I was walking the entire way. What's a tome vendor? Crafting tome vendor. Ferry tickets. I don't know what these do. I think eventually... I 
of. Eventually we'll figure it out, I guess. I can't wait for new gear. I still look like a clown. did you absolutely did I guess Vel is Vel for in the game as well then? Like, are they just always using the same... I'm still very used to calling them summons, but... Trials? You seem behemoth. It's an effort. How do they know to raid this prime lord? Ethan, um, what class do you play? White Mage. Sure.
everyone that was there, the exception of us two, has been put to death. Wow. It's not a small thing. <laughs> it's... You have to be on time. Start with that. Start with the things you can actually achieve. Buy a watch. Alright, um, let's go over here. Let's see what level... Still level 20. Hero in the making. Oh, I think now we can get to choose that, um, that grand company. I think. And company time. So we've got the uh, the burning flames. We have the uh, the maelstrom, and the other one is the serpent something, uh, which I'm not going to be selecting. Um, I'm thinking the maelstrom. But for for what I've heard, for what I understand. Is um, some people have maxed out all three of them? I'm hoping it's true. At least this will give us options to do other quests, and those will give you uh, points and with those points you can do ventures or you can buy venture tokens master fix oh no it's daily fix don't get ahead of yourself oh it's the order of the twin adder Yeah, this is actually quite awkward because the, the the flame officer is not using red. Yeah, you know I like Ulda, but I've seen how many people there are in the other guilds, and this is from the Maelstrom. So we'll make... We'll, we'll start with him. We have no allegiance to any town, so it doesn't really matter. And I'm just picking it because I've seen, like, the grand... The, uh, the free company I'm in is having, like, an alliance to them or something. I'm still not very sure what it is all about. And maybe at some point I'll create my own free company, but it's, it's more like... How dedicated am I going to be once the main story stops? Like, what will you do? Like, will you put in more time, more hours? Uh, like, are you that much enjoying the game? And that, that is usually when you should decide whether or not you create your own free company. But there are so many of them.
Yeah. It wasn't. She actually said it. The commitment you make this day is not permanent. Was he hitting on her? Yeah, even he sees like that. <laughs> Yeah, I've already made my decision. You don't have to sell it to me even more. At least the game gives you so, so much to do. That I really like. Especially with, like, the server. Like, when we hit level 80 and all of that XP drops... Um... I'm sure leveling, like, other classes will be more of a challenge. And also, we'll be, like, level 80 halfway through the story, maybe. Maybe even sooner. So, I'm not a huge fan of XP servers like this, because they're new. But the fact that they created a new server, I think is absolutely brilliant. Oh god, what do I get? Phone number. Yeah, it's it's a link, but yeah, I see. It's a phone. Say give you see doesn't give a phone number, she just gives an entire phone. Still here. So we have to go outside. Can we just talk to Nah, don't even have to talk to these guys. Okay, uh, what level? Okay, so we now have to go and travel to the area we want to be part of. So let's ho head over to Limsa. Yeah, I'll, I'm sure I'll find it, thank you. Onwards. Let us teleport to Limsa. Because it's actually... Ew, yesterday it was absolutely crowded in there. Like I said, if I go to the page... Ally to the Maelstrom... Ah, no, I'm... <laughs> They told me that it doesn't matter. Still. Still, I think it's uh, going to be quite a normal. I have to pick something, right? 
over there, hero in the making. Oh, here to the left. That's easy. There you go. Onward to the stateroom. The Garleans are another matter altogether. So much for our alliance. It's sunk beyond the seabed. Get the story. Brothers and sisters of the sea, hearken unto me. Look upon this, our mighty crimson standard, and tell me your hearts do not swell with pride. Seven hundred summers have come and gone since our forefathers first ran aground in this fertile bay. In that time, guided by the mother of oceans, Limsa Lominsa has grown from humble fishing village to uncontested ruler of the five seas and beyond. Did you look as the Admiral bid you? It is a rather stirring standard, I must say. The Crimson Field is meant to signify the blood of fallen crewmates, while the Black Longship represents a pirate vessel. When the Galian Empire marched upon Eorzea, we assembled beneath the Maelstrom Standard, and our Grand Company was reborn. All answered the call, from the Knights of the Barracuda to Hilfir's bloody executioners. And together, we met our would-be conquerors upon the field of Cartano. That day, the world bore witness to the united strength of Limsa Lominsa. I swear to you, no army ever fought harder or with more courage. Yet many of ours did not survive. Join me now in remembering those who fought in the name of freedom and fell. May their souls be returned to the sea. Freedom. Yes, they have always been rather fond of their freedom. Much as the beast tribes have. A small wonder. Beneath the surface, one would struggle to tell them apart. It has been five long years since the Calamity struck. Five long years of tireless rebuilding. Yet still the wounds of the Calamity fester and weep. But when I stand atop the mizzenmast and gaze out upon our battered and broken vessel, I see an undying spirit. Did we not build all this from the wreck of the Galadian all those centuries ago? Shall we not do so again? Yet there are those who would see this ship of ours sink beneath the waves of the restless Rotano. The Sahagin creep ashore seeking blood for their accursed god. Those fishback the bastards. The Sahagin have risen? While the mines of Ogomoro spew forth kobolds who push ever south, despoiling our lands as they go. These savage beast tribes will be the first waves to crash against our creaking hull. And behind them swells the grim tide of the Garlean Empire. Even now the Kurs fly their flags within our borders. Doubt not, but that they will be upon us ere long. We are well nigh surrounded, yet there are those among us who would rather turn their swords against their crewmates than our cannons against our foes. How can we hope to repel our many enemies when mutiny breeds below deck? There is but one course left to us. 
one bearing that will bring us victory over the Beast Hordes and the Empire both, and see this ship safe to port. We must mend the rift the Calamity has reopened twixt Pirate and Maelstrom, and stand fast with our adventurer brothers against the coming Tempest. Mark ye well, a crew without unity is no crew at all. Tis but a mass of drowned men. To me, then, brothers and sisters of the sea, gather beneath the undying crimson standard and pledge me your strength, your skill, your wisdom. And with the guidance of the Navigator, this great vessel of ours shall ride the waves till sea swallows all. Long live the Admiral! Admiral Melvin! Gather the lads! Oh, where's me cutlass? I'll follow ye to the seven hells, Admiral! Where's me cutlass? <laughs> okay. If you'll permit me, Alfie, no. And my sister, Alize, at your service. I saw at a glance that you were a fellow traveler. You might call us students of history, sampling the realm's remembrances in pursuit of enlightenment. Okay. So now we need to go to the second one. Uh, let's just go to this one. Broadening horizons. Preserving the past. Yeah, we'll have to do... Now, preserving the past is a normal quest. I don't want to be a carpenter. Uh, we'll do the broadening the horizons. Since that is uh, level 29. And we will get earrings of choice. And I don't like any of them. Well, skill speed would be nice, but it has strength. And could you just have it? And vitality? Yeah, I don't know. I uh, might just go for the money again.
Okay, okay, okay. Let's see, it's actually in this map over there. It will open up Central Shroud, apparently. And from there we will um, go listen to the story of this grand company. Yeah, that's that's the that's the thing. We'll have to listen to all of them, and I should have actually gone with a different route. And we ended with the um, with the maelstrom. Oh well. Okay. I'll take the money because I don't think it's actually beneficial the other rings doesn't have int and we are quite heavy on on int it's just how much damage we do uh, how far is the run it's actually over there so that is not too bad conjurer botanist we will have to visit the botanist as well a link shell distributor okay yeah we'll uh, we'll visit the botany group actually now because i i have the tendency to forget and I do want to be a botanist. I think it's um, just as easy as with the uh, the mining. You have some skills you will use. Yes, I'm very interested in it. It's fine. We don't need the entire background story of the botanists. Just take me to your leader. <laughs> Okay. There we go. We have now become also a botanist. So let us switch, switch the weapon to this hatchet and we go with recommended gear and we're going to be saving that no equip ah, I'm such an idiot you now um, plus botanist recommended gear now we have this one Item level 4. My advice is not to take too many classes because you will quickly run out of inventory space. Yeah, it, it's actually mainly I'm just taking it so I can get the... Um, uh, the retainer. Because I'm thinking I want one as a miner, one as a botanist. So I can actually just get supplies for when I want to do some crafting or anything. And I do want to get like a house. I'm with my um, free company. I could get a private room. And I'm just going to assume I can actually use that to uh, fill in stuff. Hopefully. Strangulate's going to be over there. We'll level this up eventually. Not right now. Let's go back over here. Quick with this. And let's run. And it gives me something else to do as well. And I like that. I, I like you, you can be so versatile. But yeah, inventory space. It's, uh, that's something. Damn. So how would you go about that? Uh, and then we have the video, so, um. We'll uh, watch that cinematic. 
take something quick. I lost my son to the Calamity. The three Seed Seers are all together. Some say you couldn't take a step without stumbling over a body. Our forebears were once strangers in the Twelve's Wood. Fearful of the Green Wrath, they hid themselves in the dark recesses of the Earth. Yet they dreamed of basking in the dappled sunlight of the forest. Through great effort, they proved their worth to the Elementals, and were granted a place beneath the boughs. So it was that Gradania was born, some five centuries ago. Working hand in hand, the Hur and the Elizan settlers sowed the seeds of our civilization, and soon they were joined by folk of all races. So nourished by the waters of unity, and blessed by the light of the matron, Gridania flourished into the great nation it is today. Do you see the Gridanian standard? There, hanging behind the Elder Seed Seer. The entwined serpents represent the unity between Hur and Elizan. An elegant symbol, do you not agree? In accordance with the will of the Elementals, we have embraced a life of peace. Alas, our neighbors have not always sought the same for themselves, nor for us. Though we Gridanians have no love for war, we have still less for those who would threaten our way of life. Ever have we fought to protect the sanctity of the Twelveswood. When the Garlean Empire brought its War of Conquest to Eorzea, we rallied under the noble standard of the Twin Adder that we might push back the encroaching darkness. And it was we who prepared the ground for the reformation of the Eorzean Alliance that all the peoples of this realm might stand united against the common threat. Five years ago, the Alliance met the armies of the Empire upon the fields of Cartano. It would prove the bloodiest battle in recent memory. Countless Gridanian lives were lost. As Supreme Commander of the Order of the Twin Adder, ever shall I bear the weight of our people's sacrifice. Alas, their loss was not the only tragedy to befall us that day, for soon came the Calamity. The scars borne by our forest are a constant reminder of its violence. Our lives have been irrevocably changed, each waking hour a struggle to survive. Driven to desperation, some among us have strayed from the path of righteousness, resorting to banditry, poaching, and other unconscionable deeds. To compound our woes, the Ixul have returned in force, emboldened by our suffering. They test our defenses nigh without cease and prey upon the vulnerable. So beleaguered from within and without, it is of little wonder that our unity now falters. Dark times are upon us. Time was a man could the walk the high roads itself. without fear. On this day, five years ago, countless Eorzeans laid down their lives that we might behold another dawn. Please join with me in honoring their memory.
And how do you propose to honor the memory of those you cannot remember, pray tell? The destruction wrought by the Calamity was indiscriminate. It dealt death to Eorzean and Garlean alike. Yet while we have labored to rebuild our homes, to rebuild our lives, the Empire has set about raising steel fortresses here in the Twelveswood. Let none be mistaken. The Garleans remain the greatest threat to our survival. If we are to stand against them, we must remember what it is to be united. Our many troubles blind us to the woes of our fellow man. Thence is harmony lost. Yet harmony is the founding principle of Gridania. We are gathered here to honor the fallen. Let them be honored not only in word and thought, but through concerted action. I bid you join hands with me once more beneath the Twin Adder Standard. And together, let us heal the forest's wounds, that our progeny might live in harmony beneath these ancient boughs. For serenity, purity, and sanctity. We must think of the children! Woods will be done! It's up to us what to protect the forest! Kill the elementals! So the dog was craving attention. Still is. But... Yeah, I'm, I'm still not sure what kind of character I would make to say like play later tonight. I'm not stream. Any anyone? If like because I was thinking maybe go like rogue. No, that could be, I think, fun. I'm not sure, Fancy though. meeting you again. Luke list I've tried. I don't like lances. Ninja's super fun. Then I will go ninja. High damage, low... Yeah, bro. Yeah. Right, let me read this up. Or I don't know what the hell is going on. Of course, when I'm making a character later tonight for myself, like... You don't have him, though. Are you just happy? Have you been watching? Like, what, what characters do you have? There is some freight train issues. Like, you can see that with how the shadow is just going, like... No, 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 I was actually referring like, like the shadow in the, sh in the game itself, like the stream is fine. Thank you for letting me know, because sometimes people don't. <laughs> and I'm looking back, because I upload the stream like to YouTube, and I'm like... Okay. Really now? So you, you definitely like the... How do you call them? Like of the hand, one is magic, the other one is the the, the absolute warrior classes. Oh. going on here all 
Right, so I guess someone got a house or something. <laughs> All right, uh, let us use the return option because we need to go to Ulda. And then we have to go back to Limsa again. Uh, I'm reckoning these guys are all in the same thing that I'm in. Wait, where is that in Ulda? Um, yeah, I know. I think I know. Go to like the center. The Royal Promenade. Which is actually here, the Chamber of Rule. <clears throat> so, you've probably went through the entire story and all. So what do you do to keep yourself like occupied? Because I can actually imagine there's a lot of stuff to be done. Hey, here we go again. Not a video. Behold, tis the Santana Nanamo herself. And Roban as well. Hark you, souls of flame, drawn to the bosom of the desert, where the fire burns brightest and shall rage forevermore. Hurrah! Rauban! Where since antiquity, under the sage and judicious rule of the Ul dynasty, we have wrought sand into gold. Where by the grace and glory of Naldar, have our brave sons and daughters flourished and prospered? I speak of Ulda! Hey. Still... There, Many at the Flame General's back, flies the Grand right. Company's standard. Note the sigil. The golden scales of order balance the jewel of prosperity with the flame of might. Great and many are the gifts our nation has given the realm. In Eorzea's darkest hour, on the killing fields of Cartano, none spent more in blood and gold than we. Thus was the Seventh Imperial Legion laid low. So that's how it happened. How soon history forgets. Yet many left our gates never to return. Opens the guard side. Let us pray for our absent brothers and sisters, that they might know happiness in the great beyond, as Thor's honored guests. If the fates were fair, the price we paid that day would have bought us victory. Alas, they are not. And now, but five years into this seventh umbral era, the spirit of sacrifice which granted us our strength is all but dead. Look around you. What do you see? A people divided, downtrodden, and enthralled. Where are the merciful alms of the rich? Where is the just steel of the righteous? I ask you, is this the great nation our brothers and sisters gave their lives to save? You who call this living, Dishonor the name of the immortal flames. It is but a slow death. Our enemies surround us. The savage hordes of the Amalja wait beside our roads, strangling the lifelines of trade. Meanwhile, the Garlians make mock of our borders and despoil our land of its natural wealth. We stand on a precipice. Yet we do not act. Whether trader or soldier, monetarist or royalist, all must recognize that a divided Uldar stands to fall. Victory and fortune walk hand in hand. Ye who seek glory and wealth, look not to what little you can snatch from your neighbor. 
but to the boundless wealth of the world beyond. Now is the time to unite. Now is the time to ride forth. In the name of the Sultana, I beseech you. Line not your own coffers, but those of the immortal flames. Seek not to prosper from Uldah, but to restore her to prosperity. As the realm prospers, so shall Uldah. As Uldah prospers, so shall her people. Ya yeah, for Uldah! Together we are one. Your grace. Absolutely well love Rabban. So good. And he's using a parrot again. People of Ulda, I, Nanimo, 17th in the line of Ul, address you. Much has been made of the wealth of Ulda. Yet those who measure that wealth in coins and carrots are gravely deceived. For the true wealth of Ulda lies in the health, happiness, and hopes of her people. Beloved subjects, I bid you raise aloft the torch of Ulda, that her flames might serve as a beacon for all Eorzea to see. Long live Nanamo! Glory to the Sultana! For victory and fortune, stride fearless into the inferno, for we are by fire reborn! Uh, seems like I have a good good class then i could be a healer there with fire reborn here i am saying Our cleanse soul. them with the fire i believe i fancy believe. meeting you again yeah we we met them we met them we met ifrit yeah okay i like it they take that into effect then again, everyone fights Ifrit, I believe. Like the second you come into that sand uh, location or that that uh, everyone's storyline, I think is the same. When the dogs is in again. Of course, the other one is outside now. Actually, not looking forward to my night shift today. Slept so poorly. Like, I woke up. I went to bed like 4 a.m. I woke up at 10, 6 hours. I was hoping for a good 8, maybe 9. I wouldn't be streaming right now. <laughs> ah, second one is in. So we can make a decision on Grandpa. So, we're going to be selecting, I think, the Maelstrom, even though Raban is an absolute badass. And, uh, uh, the reason still is because of this. Like, I, I, it doesn't really matter for what I've been told. And also, um, that the Mil Milfila also told us, like, it's not permanent. Other dungeon here. Yeah, we're getting close to 25, so these are going to be synced somewhat. Also, not sure how I'll use fire free yet. 
because it is extremely expensive. I can only do like three times. I have to switch, do something else. But yeah, we'll uh, we'll see. Uh, report to the walking sand now. Okay, last time we did do a lot of walking. <laughs> This time, however, we won't. And I have... How many venture points do I still have? Can I look into that stuff? Um, I think I just... I only have one. So I will have to do this one first. All classes are fun. That's definitely true. Definitely. Use this. FC house party at Little's when you get there. All right. uh, many class are pure dress until early sixty, like the white mage. Okay, that's, that is actually good to know, because, you know, when, when you start leveling like a white mage, and you're like, oh, this sucks. It explains why there's not many people, like, like there's so few white mages, like, early game. Uh, I might consider doing that as a second class, like, black mage, white mage. I'm sure that white mage has more concentration or something, I'm not sure, but... Um. Oh, he has a chocobo. I want a chocobo. Oh, looking very forward to that then. So far, I, I like this class. I know it goes into Black Mage. And there's so many classes. That it's absolutely insane. I really like that. And, but, I, but I'm wondering, I am wondering, like, they had last year, was it last year they did the, the Shadow Sword, Shadow Sword, Shadow Sword, or whatever, did the upgrade to DLC, or was that the year before? Like, because I, I, want, I wonder, how long will they, like, continue? Because they gave it a number, like, it's not like... With World of Warcraft, it's like World of Warcraft, you, they can just add upon it. But they had like Final Fantasy 11. And then they get Final Fantasy 14. So, say it's free. There's 14, 15, 16. So Final Fantasy 17 would probably be an MMO. Probably. But when, when does it stop? When do they just make... Final Fantasy Online. And just just build up on like like a foundation and they, they can just just get the entire law in there. Like this this is already very law heavy, of course, right? There's a lot of chat going on, a lot of uh just, just and not not that many people like that. There's so much reading to be done. Personally, I would be a, a huge fan of everything main characters say, like uh, Menphilia. Like that is this is a main quest that she reads everything out. I would really be thinking that would be great. What I like with Final Fantasy, it's it's subscription based. There's no bullshit in a cash shop. The gods only know what grand company our adventurer friend will keep. Oh, I know, I know. The wheels of change are in motion regardless. Brother, are you certain this course is best? Whatever do you mean, dear sister? The so-called remembrance ceremonies were little more than standard waving rallies. Of course. As though the Calamity and Seventh Umbral Era warranted scarcely a mention. Well, of course they were standard waving rallies. Yeah, 
It's normal. Since you are so observant, mayhap you noticed what mention was made of the Warriors of Light? None. I suppose they must have forgotten the heroes who spared Eorzea a fate worse than the Calamity? No, dear Alizé, they haven't forgotten these details. They have elected to omit them. Deep are the wounds the Calamity inflicted upon Eorzea. So deep, in fact, that the realm still bleeds. Needless to say, the Beast Tribes and their primals do little to alleviate the pain. So, the task of salving Eorzea's wounds falls to the Scions of the Seventh Dawn, with a little help from our friends, the Grand Companies. Remembrance will yield no remedy. If our world is to heal, we must put the horrors of the Calamity behind us. Our grandfather would never entrust the fate of the realm to despots who rewrite history to their convenience. Temper, temper. There must be another way to cure what ails this world, and I mean to find it. Oh, she's going to be evil, probably. You are most welcome to try. Our paths may differ, but our destination is the same. In time, I dare say, we will see eye to eye. I should hope so. M -m my lady! We are to escort you! Hope does not come into it. We share the burden of this fate, dear sister, and will prevail together or not at all. The salve will serve not only to close up our present wounds, but prevent old ones from opening anew. Okay, wow. This, uh... God, I think we spent like an hour. So yeah, a lot of people just say there's too much dialogue. But we're going for the Storm Officer, the Maelstrom. There we go. And we get uh, some red dye. Raw. I wonder, I, I wonder, I really am curious, because I've never, I've mentioned several times, like, I had a character that was a dragon, dragoon, and uh, level 40, level 50 something, and, and I didn't like it at all, jumped all over the bloody place, and, and it was awful, I really didn't like it. And, and then the wife stopped as well playing, and eventually that just bores the hell out of me. So I'm happy that I'm actually streaming this right now. Alright, so we chose the Maelstrom. So we'll have to go over to Limza. Luminza. We will! Right now, because this, this episode has been... Really? <laughs> dragon. Dragon videos. I wonder if there's actually in the, something in that we can immediately do. Uh, we need to go to Upper Decks. Aft Castle. Uh, good to know. We can also set this as a home point, but I, I'm not sure if that is what we want to do right now. There we go. And I believe we can purchase with the quartermaster. We can purchase ventures. And the ventures we can use for our peoples. 
There we go. Wow. Oh yeah, that's so full of ourselves. I believe you were expecting me. Okay. Rescue mission. Don't just call me Fix. I ain't, I ain't no mechanic. Okay. Milstrom mission. Level 20 still, man. Um, we have not attuned over here. And it is by far the easiest way. We'll go here, we'll attune. And we'll run over towards this, uh, this one quest. Because we do need to go to all maps eventually and... Did not mean to press that button. Let's go. Uh, lower lacrosse. Um, that actually would not be a bad idea either. To go to lower. And then just run up. We also have to tune over there. Could I... I just get like a choke about. Well, if we could. Level twenty. Oh, no, level ten. Ah, level ten is fine. Go with sneak, auto run. The land is not bad at all. Oh, I'm actually over there. We should. Ah, uh, well, whatever. It's fine. Where the heart is, the mist this probably gives me uh, another living quarters. Worry about that later. A wild dodo has appeared. Right, what is this? This is level 10. Uh, we need to hit. I'm hoping that there is ores that I didn't hit yet. And there is the earth shot. We'll hit that as well. We'll uh, finish this up. There we go. Only earth then. So I'll have to find others. Yeah, so level 10 is the highest level in this map. Great. Okay, let's go switch back. Oh, look at you. In fancy and all. Nice. Why is the music gone? The airship. I'm 
should probably get like alt. Yeah, we'll name this bar alt up to six. Actually, we'll just do the entire thing. Eight. Zero. Stripe. And equal. There we go. And come on, man. That's why I want to catch up with my storyline. Because I keep getting level sync to 24. They didn't see me rush in with a red shirt. No, not the dodo. I just have to take my word for it. We'll save the Lollafell. It's fine. Let's cleanse them with fire. Hey, this guy first. an area attack by the way it's also possible level 24 so next mission we could actually lose um there um no see him One more, then we switch. Oh, never mind. I had to switch. Was si what? Why did I think it was like less? Ah, 
I'm killed too, you don't want. Oh, we can actually type over it. Oh, that I... Wow, really? Now we know this, huh? Okay, okay, nice. That archer's really positioned well. He should be proud. Hopefully that helps him a bit. The Adel. He is taking a bit of a beating. That Conjurer also. Like, why are you over there, mate? Why are you standing next to the tank? Oh, why do I switch my... Uh... That's better. Where are you going? Venomous Bite. That's a cool name, I'll give him that. He looks cool, I like it. Alright, now we have to start paying attention, because I don't think any of them can actually... Okay, we it's already done. Man. I was starting to worry about my NPCs and I can't heal them. Well, it happened. Could have been. Could have been an Imperial spy, who knows? You don't know me. I don't know who you don't know. Okay, let us go teleport back to Timson. Even though we could have walked. I could have walked to the central and then... Oh well. Mistakes were made. Aft castle. We'll probably spend uh, some portion of time here.
Storm Seal is 300. Level 20. There you go. Get my sword, man. I don't my music. I'm a mage. <laughs> Alright. Till the sea swallows all. I'm so proud of myself for this moment. Uh, my phone is ringing in my head. I need to go back to the walking sense already. Yeah, that, that, that's uh, not something I will be doing right now. I want to take a look at um, what you can do with this uh, grand company. I never actually bothered, so that's a mistake I made. So, I think we already have like 300 points. Oh, my little chocobo! Yes! Finally! Oh, yes! Uh, my little chocobo is the quest you need to get. I... Chocobo. No, the days of running is over. Soonish. Alright, so... Okay. Great. Uh-huh. Uh, cool as chocobo. Like it. Supply mission. Yeah, this is the one. The Grand um, Personal Officers Delivery Missions. And I think that is something my retainers should be able to do. Let's talk to him. Yeah, so, what we would do is, like, have a, uh, a miner go get the copper sand, right? And they request 10, and we would get 128 seals for that. And with the botanists, we should go with that. 
expert delivery is not part of it. I don't see fighting things with them. But you'll get seals for these, and these seals we can transfer into uh, ventures. Um, it seems like you can do these once a day. So we would have to start sending out our uh, retainers to get like copper cent. Or we have to do this ourselves. It's probably doable for both. Kind of depends on what like what level it is, I guess. We have no points. Like, I love that you can get weapons out of this. Like it's expensive, but there is decent weapons here. We'll actually get. A set bonus for when we use the Maelstrom uniform. Spell speed plus 5. Tristan. Crit hit plus 9. That's a conjurer. Okay, nice. So, if we have those points, we can definitely use them to get some cool gear. Okay, what's up with that? Disciples of magic. Come on, where's the magic? We absolutely just have to go with all classes. I don't think that is fair. Yeah, we'll have to go with all classes. Wow, really? Disciples of War, you can be cool. And then all classes. Everything else. Now we have one in the back. So, is there a bell here to, like, ring your retainers? Something over here as well. My little chocobo. Like I said, I'm not going to do that right now. Company chest hunting board. Interesting. <laughs> Thank God I have a mute button. <laughs> some seals over here as well and then there's also weeklies yeah we'll have to start unlocking the entire map and I'm thinking we'll have to do that once we get like um, a joke about it's a frontline attendance what do you do mate Ah, okay, well, that's great. Good for you. And there is also this stuff, which I have no clue what you are. Oh, these are the free companies. Oh, you can find... Oh. Yeah, not doing that. <laughs> there is something over there, that's for sure. Mm, anything I can do right now. We're going to be taking my little chocobo, because I do want one. And no longer a puppet. We'll take both of them. We'll get the chocobo whistle. Uh, it, it's, it's still, you won't get it right away. It's just a quest, and my god, look at this. Beginning your training easiest. Yeah, we'll do those. So, my little chocobo is...
Present a storm chocobo insurance. Wait, what? Maybe it's in here. There you go. So we need 200 points and then we will have our Storm Chocobo insurance. Should not be too difficult when I'm streaming next time. And this is still level 20 I think. Yeah, I will actually once we got this we'll have 300 points can come back we'll get a choke but we'll do that next time anyways thank you so much for watching guys i uh, have to do some other things because well night shift huh yay night shift so nice so thank you so much um if you even yeah been a good help a um, lot of information especially the level 60 stuff is quite intriguing We're looking forward to that and i will try a rogue later today oh you had your last night shift i'm having three today eight hours tomorrow 12 and sunday 12 hours so i'm looking very much forward to that are you it, this is going to be a long night <laughs> so uh have a good one thank you for being here appreciate it hey see you all later bye bye